Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Just recently, I did a range review with the Springfield Armory Ronin in 10 millimeter. And as I edited that, and as I watched myself, I realized I did one thing in particular very wrong. And I decided to keep it in the video because it's a teachable moment for both of us. And I wanna go over that now because I did not holster the handgun after I drew and shot and I reholstered and I did not holster it safely. I actually flagged myself each and every time I did that. Now, here we have an unloaded firearm. And I want to demonstrate first what I did. I drew, I fired, I came in, and I pointed the gun right at my hip as I holstered. I have attended several training classes and I cannot remember once when that was discussed. Now, it may have been, I just can't remember. So what happened was, a gentleman contacted me who's a trainer and he said, hey look, I noticed this, I did not want to make this comment public on YouTube, but this is how I teach my students how to do it. And I thought about it and I said, you know, that's great information, I'm going to make a video about that so that everybody can see this, use me as the poor example but at this point, hopefully use me as the safe example. All right, so I draw the firearm. Instead of pointing it toward me, I'm going to make contact with my body and twist the firearm right back into the holster. That's a safe way to go. At no point did I flag myself. I draw, bring in contact right here, twist in. Now that's a little, there's a, a little more of a process to it because it's a 1911 it's a full-size holster but it doesn't matter you know it, it has to be done safely and that's what I did not do but I will from now on and I'm hoping that you do as well too many times people think they know everything in the gun world whether it's uh, particular types of guns shooting self-defense scenarios second amendment they're full of crap nobody knows everything we have to constantly learn throughout this process you know it never ends now here i've got my car p9 appendix carry this does have a round in the chamber as it should it should not matter okay i take care of what i have to do i make contact here twist holster same thing it doesn't matter where on the body it is do what i have to do contact right here twist holster that's the safe way to go and I really appreciate the gentleman who got a hold of me and, and let me know that. I actually uh, contacted him and said, I'm gonna take it a step further and make a video about that because I want everybody to see what I did wrong and I want them to perhaps evaluate themselves and if they're not sure, then try that way, all right? It's a good way to go and you're not flagging yourself. You make contact with your Right, the fat part of the palm makes contact, twist right into the holster. It's a safe way to go. So take this information, do what you will with it, but it's very important to me that everybody remains safe and also understand that I am an expert on nothing, and I mean nothing except one thing, and that is loving you. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.